Have you ever wondered what it's like to skate on five wheel rollerblades? Today's your lucky day because we're going to explore that together. In this video, I'm gonna take you through my first three sessions on the Endless Arc Trinity Frame, which is a five wheel setup. And at the very end, I'm going to share my opinions about the frame, the experience I had, and which session I enjoyed the most. A rocker frame basically means that the middle wheels on a skate are a little bit lower down. So that creates a little bit of a rocker. So the outer wheels are gonna be a smidge higher, which means that to have a feeling almost as if you're like on an ice skate, essentially. Endless had the arc frame out for like over a year, I think over a year and a half. It's been a while. So I was pretty excited when the arc frame came out for Trinity. The biggest advantage of the Trinity frame is it's going to be significantly lower than a 165, which means more power, more control, a little bit more forgiving. You have a lower center of gravity. It's crazy. even kidding it's like hitting out of hand it's everywhere look at this everywhere everywhere you guys have to chill chill it'd be a great skating spot right here and then some toe pivots. Definitely hockey adjacent. So here's natural. And then we'll, we're gonna do unnatural. And that's a toe pivot. Go around Pierce 76 a little bit. Test out the edges. 
Shout out to Oshik for filming. Oh, that golden hour. So they're like long, but they're not crazy long. Very, very snappy. We're gonna make a wide turn here, you ready? Should we try some slides? It's our new wheels. That was better. Gotta bend my knees more. I think that was my best one so far. Ah. There we go.
Okay, so these are my final thoughts, which I know you care a lot and you've been waiting so patiently until the, the end of the video to get to. I really enjoyed the experience of this frame. They were uh, super fun, super playful, extremely responsive, quick when I needed them to be. They were definitely a little bit on the longer side, but not in a bad way. It took some getting used to, but enjoyed exploring the different creative possibilities that a five wheel awkward frame offers. My favorite session was definitely the third one, A, because it was actually a nice day, and I felt like I understood how the, the frame behaved enough to actually start exploring different kinds of movements. And while I didn't really have a lot of structure with any of my movements, it was just extremely fun. Popped in music and just with the flow. in the description for these frames, which is the Arc Trinity frames. If you have any questions about this, put it in the comments. I will try to answer as many of them as I can, and we'll try to ask Brad, who is the designer of Endless Products, to help out with any questions you might have. If you want to purchase a pair, check out the link in the description. These are also endless wheels as well, and they come in full sets. As always, thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for all the support. I appreciate each and every one of you. I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.